Welcome to Metal Heroes, where we celebrate the treasure trove of robot masters across the Mega Man franchise. Today marks the first episode of a new season set to roll out on a monthly basis. Speaking of bases, it's time to dig into the characters of Mega Man in base with the dynamic King Numbers. And speaking of a power dynamic, we're gonna get this current flowing with Dynamo Man. Dynamo Man is an honest robot and a real live wire, originally created to serve as a tour guide for school field trips to the power plant he worked in. And Dynamo Man loved his work and the social interactions that it provided. Upon being recruited to Kane's army, Kane modified him, fitting him with his own private generator, which creates a powerful electric barrier. However, the power output overloads his circuits, causing Dynamo Man to go haywire. I guess you could say he no longer knew how to conduct himself. Therefore, Dynamo Man was considered a work hazard, and people began avoiding him. This in turn made Dynamo Man resentful and began to doubt himself, regretting his modifications. And it would be these modifications that power his special weapon, the Lightning Bolt, which also enables him to recharge his own energy. Talk about high voltage. to reach Dynamo Man's database CD. Good luck, Mega Man! Dynamo Man was designed by manga artist Ariga Hitoshi, known for the incredible Rockman, Mega Mix, and Giga Mix manga. He was originally created under the name Coil Man. His theme music was composed by Naoshi Mizuda, known for creating the theme of Dan Hibiki in Street Fighter and his work over at Square Enix, such as Parasite Eve 2 and some contributions to the incredible soundtrack of Final Fantasy XI. Rockman and Forte, 1998. Dynamo Man makes his debut and only mainline appearance to date. In this game, Dynamo Man dashes around the arena, firing slow electrified tendrils, which must be avoided or, if playing as base, can be destroyed more easily. Dynamo will also summon his special weapon, the Lightning Bolt, from the ceiling. He may also throw out his electric eyes towards his target. If that weren't enough, Dynamo Man can recharge his health energy. However, both his attacks and his recharging can be avoided by his greatest weakness, the copy vision, which is sure to do more than make his coils whine. The answer is the fire wave. Alright Mega Bros, thanks for watching, and now that we pulled the plug on Dynamo Man, coming up next time on Metal Heroes, we're dishing up a Robot Master that's best served cold. So until next time, this is Den Den, signing off.